Hey, what's up everybody? I'm calling this segment Update Sunday. I'm, I'm trying to make sure that um, I'm consistent with the videos, but I also don't want to get ahead of myself and put too much on my plate. So I've decided to vlog as much as I possibly can. I want to try to do it on a daily basis, but I think that some days I'm just not going to because if I put that pressure on myself to come up with something every day, I really want this to be organic. So I really want to feel like, oh, I'm just grabbing my camera because something cool is going on and I want to share it with you guys as opposed to forcing myself to every day come up with something new to uh, make a video about. I'm working on some guitar lesson videos and it's my first time doing these types of videos and I just want them to be better. And so I'm putting a little bit more effort into them. So they're gonna take a bit more time to make. That's what I've seen because I, I literally just spent the last two hours trying to make a, a video about chords and I just wasn't ready. I was trying to figure out what angles, I figured it out, but it was like after filming for an hour. So. I need to refilm that and re-edit it and make it make sense. So, so yeah, so I'm not gonna put that pressure on myself, but I am gonna be consistently uploading um, to this channel via this vlog. And um, yeah, so I hope you guys like that. I just wanna also give you an update on the equipment that I have ordered. So my final decision was to get the Machina MK3. And I looked at the Plus and I looked at reviews and it was just too much. I, I don't need a standalone groove box. Like I don't mind using the computer and the, the groove box at the same time. Plus I've had a Machina in the past. That was like the first groove box I ever had was the Native Instruments um, machine. So I know I'm calling it Machine, Machina, I don't know. It's machine to me. I've heard people say machina in these reviews, so I think it's like a European thing. I don't know. But anyway, I know the basics of how it works, and I know that I love the Native Instruments sounds that comes with it. So really knowing the workflow um, better and preferring the native instrument sounds kind of won me over, which is why I didn't choose the MPC-1. I looked at a lot of videos for the MPC-1, but the workflow just didn't, it didn't interest me. And the sounds, I know you can just add sample packs and stuff, but with the machine, I don't have to buy sample packs. I can just use the native instruments and be good. But for me, I don't need a lot to get my creative ideas out and I know how to use DSTs to um, make them your own sound so I'm I'm not worried about that and uh, I'm definitely not worried about running out of sound because I also have the uh, Ableton Live 11. I'm doing the 90 day trial and it's going great. I am really enjoying this way more than I thought I would. I think I've just found some really good uh, tutorial videos, which again made me think, man, I really wanna step up my game and make sure my guitar tutorials are as good as these tutorials because you, you're actually learning something. So that's why I'm taking my time more with the guitar lessons. But yeah, I found some really great tutorials on Ableton Live and I'm very excited. There's also some great tutorials on arranging shows, so I can't wait to get into that, but I have to actually um, start making music with it and stuff. I did start uh, making music last night with Ableton, and it was really exciting. So I just feel really creative right now. I ordered the MK3, the Machine MK3, and it's supposed to be here on Monday. So when it comes, I'll do the, you know, the unboxing, and we'll hook it up together and just see what it's all about, you know, and that'll be a cool video. I can't wait for that. So yeah, just waiting for the machine to get here. I'm still learning the Ableton and I'm actually gonna go back and uh, watch the rest of the tutorial I was watching last night, learning some stuff. And yeah, I'm, I'm really excited. I mean, I'm really excited about this new music and um, the possibilities um, of growing out my home studio. And yeah, 
so that's the update this this is the first update sunday and that's what it is uh, also this week coming up i have a gig um, at a blues club here in chicago called rosa's lounge and i will be vlogging that gig in its entirety so stay tuned for that that's going to be um friday friday night so that vlog will be posted on saturday um, but yeah so it's a lot going on this week it should be a fun week of videos also if you have any ideas for guitar lessons like specific things you want to learn about guitar um, please put it in the comment section below because i'm looking for ideas to build on for this channel um, also any musical things even if it's um, production questions or whatnot um, you can look at my uh, discography on Spotify and listen to the things that I have uh, made in this home studio so that you know that I do know what I'm talking about as far as production goes and if you have any questions please feel free to ask I know a whole bunch about logic because that's what I have been using for years so if you have any questions about that let me know also garage band so and then soon I'll be a master of Apleton. Oh yeah. So thanks for watching as always. I really appreciate it. Give any video you watch of mine a thumbs up and subscribe and hit the notification bell. It helps the channel. I want this channel to be a resource for musicians and producers, just artists in general. I want this to be a resource of information. If you'd like to support this channel, please sign up for my Patreon page, which should be on the screen somewhere. And thanks for watching once again, and I'll see you in the next video. Be good to each other. I love y'all. Peace.